Hi, I'm Angela, an entrepreneur, a beauty queen, model, and mother. And my passion is to empower you to shine. So let's get the magic started. Come take a look at my complete emerald collection and amethyst collection. Stay tuned. Okie dokie, so let's introduce you to uh, one of my latest um, uh, items in my collection which was like probably a good four years ago before the pandemic and this is the beauty, the emerald earrings. Um, I really really loved it, I fell in love with it. As soon as I saw it, let's take it out for you to have a look. And um, okay, so I decided to put it on so that you can have a proper look. And look how stunning it is, right? Um, the dingle dangles and the row of three emeralds, simply stunning. I really, really love it. And um, yeah, I. I don't own any Admirals prior to year 2020 and when I saw this, I was blown away. It's like so beautiful. But obviously, it's not something you can wear daily. It's only for occasions. And let's have a look at it close up. This is what it looks like close up. Um, these are all natural stones, natural emeralds. Actually, the lighting doesn't do it justice. The green is actually way, way more vibrant in person and the dangle earrings, um, the tassels. I really love the tassels. And the back is like this. Okay, Just a simple stud, stud. But look how cute the backing is. Okay, look, yeah, it's a pretty long backing to secure the, the stone. I mean, the, to secure it on your ears, right? Yeah, so beautiful. And um, after buying this, I did see a beautiful emerald ring. So stunning and I just needed to get it and it's the same I most pretty I had to get it the same color when I buy stones I prefer to buy the same color um, however I do have a few stones that are not the same color in the complete set I just feel like when they're the same color stones you know the hue it makes your set way more complete right so this is my emerald set mm, love it to bits only worn it once <laughs> since i bought it for a wedding um looking forward to wearing it more often but you know can't really walk into town just like this it has to be a beautiful event so this is my emerald collection and let's look at the next let's introduce you to my amethyst collection i wonder if the lighting let's change the lighting and see if the, the stone looks better like you can barely see the purple on this lighting hang on let me check okay so i've changed the lighting i think it looks way way better um this is the amethyst the purple this is a pendant um, that you can wear here. This is what it looks like. And um, as you can tell, I love, love dingle dangles. <laughs> and to complement is a matching ring. Okay, we've seen this in my previous video. It's way more vibrant with this lighting here. And as you can see also the stone this is what the comparison so difficult to okay yeah. this this looks way more vibrant right more purple i think maybe it's also the cut yeah yeah 
All right, and um, I did get Machi Machi earrings too. These are the Machi Machi earrings that I got um, to complement the entire set. I'm not sure, like, oh, focusing is so terrible. I'm not sure if it's this ring light, but it's definitely not my phone. Um, because I've been using it in Abu Dhabi. I'm now currently in Malaysia, hence why I have access to my jewelry. So this is what it looks like on. It's beautiful. And um, also, hardly wore it, hardly wore it. Um, maybe once or twice. And uh, okay. As you, and you can see also the amethyst on the earring is a different hue again. So I'm actually like not completely happy that you know the ring, the pendant and the earrings are all you know not they're all purple but all a different purple, right? Let's have a look. And but it's so hard to find beautiful designs and the same color hue, okay? So hard to find. And um, yep. so I should be happy, right? But uh, yeah, so that is my complete amethyst collection. I love colored stones. I collect them in different, um, you know, I find uh, colored stones really interesting and especially, you know, um, collecting them from around the world. Um, that does that does make me feel good um, from my travel. So every time I travel, I like to find items, jewelry items um, from that country. Uh, yeah, but these these items are all from Singapore, the ones that I'm sure I've showed you today. And um, they are all, uh, and my jewelry collection uh, span over 30 years. I got my first jewelry from my mom, and thereafter, every occasion, uh, from my husband, purchases that I buy from myself as well, and uh, yeah, every almost every item has a memory, and that's what I love about it. So, hence the extensive collection of jewelry because it is 30 years in the making. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, to me, jewelry are heirloom pieces. I have many, many pieces from my mom and my grandmother as well. Um, and uh, I hope to showcase them to you eventually. But yeah, heirloom pieces. All these jewelry will be given to my two daughters eventually. And granddaughters. <laughs> when they come along. So cheers everyone and look forward to the next video. Ta-ta!